All right, so in this class, after we've talked about momentum, um, <clears throat> we're going to talk about calculating impulse, which is the force that it takes to change something's momentum. All right, so one equation for impulse, there are a few of them, but we're just going to look at one in here, is I equals M delta V. All right, and so I is impulse. Okay, and impulse is measured in newtons. So remember I said it's a force um, that changes the momentum of an object. All right, so impulse is measured in newtons. Then we have m, and you already know what m is. m is mass, okay? And we most commonly are gonna see mass measured in kilograms. Cool. So after mass, we have delta v. So delta v. And that is the change in velocity. Okay? So you're finding the change in something's velocity. And you know when you, when you have change in something, you're probably going to have to subtract two different numbers or find the difference between them. Anyways, velocity is measured in meters per second. That's the most common unit you're going to see it measured in. 